I'd leave St Martin's at 10 o'clock each night and then ride across to South London. As I'd go across, I'd go past the Tate. I could see the uh, ice sculptures there. I went down and I sat by it, took in the uh, spectacle and felt them and, and sort of listened to other people. <laughs> Cut! <laughs> the ice cap. <laughs> <laughs> I was watching everybody interacting with the sculptures. But I noticed that because it was uh, so warm, the uh, ice sculptures were like dripping. And I started to think about how they'd been formed uh, a very long time ago. And then how, you know, in that moment, after all that time, it was defrosting. It's kind of like when a leaf falls from the tree, you know, it's been up there all the time and it comes to autumn, it will drop. I decided that I would uh, get a bottle um, from the bins and put it underneath the sculpture and start collecting the water. And I was really conscious about doing this. And during the period of collecting the water, one of the staff came out and gave me a chair to sit on. Some of the sculptural pieces were falling apart and people were coming along and they were like kicking the sculpture, the ice around on the floor and throwing it and the, the, you know, they're generally abusing the, the ice that was left there. And I saw a piece of ice on the floor I thought to myself, like, I could pick that bit of ice up now and take it back with me. So when no one was looking, I sort of put my bag down <laughs> and picked this piece of iceberg up from Greenland and shoved it in my bag and uh, then proceeded to ride back to Camberwell, found the freezer there and then put them in the freezer there to preserve them. I had to move out of the uh, accommodation in Camberwell, so I had nowhere to put the ice. So I walked into the St. Martins and uh, said to them, you know, is there any way I can put some ice? And the head of the kitchen was like, well, what sort of ice is it? And I was like, oh, it's from an iceberg in Greenland and, uh, you know, we're preserving it and we're going to be making art with it. She's told the chefs about it and, uh, and uh, they, they put it on freeze. 